Where is he going? What the hell? Hey, OJ. But anyway, it won't go far. Hey, OJ. Come on here. So, anyway, it was just like uh, so called Dr. Sarah Davidson. Uh, the one that said, uh, the one that said the King Street, King Street Pharmacy. She always said, you know, like, people that's on crystal meth must be treated with respect and must be part of the community. Like she said with the, uh, when she bought the abortion clinic, she said, we're going we're to change this into a rooming house, not for recovery, for recovery program for people that want to get off meth. We're going to change it into people that's on meth, right beside the school. And she said it right plain. The, the people in the area, the principal was concerned. She said, well, I'll listen to her concern, but it's still going there. So that's the attitude. Now, yesterday, what happened? Somebody, um, Baker's Point, Burgers Point, Baker's Point, Burgers Point, you can tell I'm not from this area, uh, said that three, three bicycle of his kids were stolen. What else? Toolbox from his shed. So he decided he knew there was a tent city for the Met heads. They set up not far away. So he took it, took it upon his own to go there. Guess what happened? He was surrounded by guys with knives and said, get out of here. Thank God it's not down the stairs. He would have been shot. But then again, we had four people that were shot dead uh, a few years ago here, including two cops. Now, focus shows. So this is, this is the people you deal with as part of the community. That you say, DOG, DOG, come on here. DOG, come here. Go there. Hi. You're riding a bicycle now? That's good. So, you're part of the community. This is our people that's on Crystal Met. Here, step here. Step here for a second. Hey. Yuji. Yuji. Hey. You're not gonna... Hey. Yuji. Go here. Oh, attitude. Yuji. DOJ. Go here. There. Look. Hey. Hey. Get on there. Yuji. Get there. Hey. There. Okay. Look for some Met heads. See any Met heads around? Too busy sniffing. So, uh, so they, they surrounded the guy with knives. Now, are these guys being charged? Of course not, because he would have recognized them anyway. But that's what we're dealing with. People that dare to voice a complaint or dare to fight back, they will be surrounded with knives and they were, they're gonna get killed. I know, I'm surprised that hasn't happened to me yet. I was uh, threatened Saturday We'll mention no names, but we'll, we'll see what's going to happen. I mean, you don't fool around. But then again, the court system is a different different factor. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to court, and we're going to find uh, Robbie McDonald, this victim impact assessment thing. So stay tuned, and we'll see what's going to happen. Wow. <laughs>